Here's the kicker, Harrison Butker, ready to get this one started. And off we go from Seattle. Pulls it in at the 13. Lane opens here. He's past the 30. The Seahawks take over first down. Like doing it, but you have to also look at how well Russell Wilson has played at the quarter. Accelerating, and off he goes. <laughs> the 20. Bring it. Dumpster juice, boy. And the Seahawks have taken a first quarter lead. <laughs> and they said they wanted to have some explosive runs. Oh, it's going to gonna be a long game. game. On the defensive sideline, there's a lot it's going to be a long for. game, Because huh? you spend all week saying, stop the run. I don't care who you're playing. You don't want to get run over. You don't want to get run past. And they have both over committing in the secondary. And he... And from the shotgun, he'll throw. And he'll be hit as he... They don't have the tuck rule that they can fall back on anymore. <laughs> Mahomes will try again on second down. He's going to look deep for Watkins. And that's going to be <laughs> in. And that has him staring at a third and ten. He'll buy some time right. He may try and run for this. And I think the ball's out. Thank you. And he will be on getting to the first down marker. Forgot to cover up and take care of the ball. And that'll hurt the app. Now on second and 16. Wilson over the dim. You make your defense mad. Yeah. They got you the football, gave you a great opportunity. You got to cash in and get some points. And they're going to get him down well short of the first as he can only get this to the 30. That one good for only six, and it leaves him with a fourth down. And for a second there, I thought that might break big. Screen. And he will score. Touchdown, uh -oh. Seattle. Greg Olson, 30 yards. And the Seahawks add on to their lead. Not even two minutes into this football game, already we've had two scores. You know how much I like to read about teams of old, right? The, the teams of yesteryear. There were some teams that were known as the point-a-minute teams. Well, obviously a 60-minute game at 60 plus points. But two touchdowns in the first two minutes? My calculator a, 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 a newborn ain't even going to believe that. We haven't gotten off the bus yet. Takes this about five yards deep. Monday night football in week three, and they'll get another tough test week four as the Patriots come to Arrowhead. The first carry now, this is Williams. And he'll get this up. Oaks are on the field, and they're only thinking one thing get to the quarterback. Oftentimes, you can bypass him with a running play. Now, a deep ball going to the races. First and ten. Here's Mahomes. Complete the tight end, Kelsey. And a gain of four gets him second and six. From midfield, here's Mahomes. Pass the tw And he's free going down the left side. It's a foot race. And all the way in for a Kansas City touchdown. Demarcus Robinson. 50 yards, and the Chiefs are able to get this back within a touchdown. They were already down two scores early. They needed something to try to stem that tide, and that certainly qualifies a big play to get them in the end zone. It qualifies indeed because, let's face it, they don't get something done on this drive, turn it back over. This game could be 88 and out the gate early. What? 88 and out the gate? Yeah. What's that? Well, listen, I used to hear my Dang. old man talk about it. It usually meant <laughs> that thing's done. Well, now that they got the touchdown, it's, it's not 88 and out the gate. We still got a good oh, game going man. ahead of us. That is crazy. Now he's back out there to boom this one away, maybe with some frustration after the PAT miss. And up over Dak and the Dallas Cowboys, but Russell Wilson, who has famously never gotten so much as an MVP wow. vote, producers is telling me in my ear that that's more than anyone has ever thrown through three games. And he can't find a receiver, and he's brought down. Sometimes the offensive line can't hold up, and he ends up hitting the deck on those plays. And he finds a man, it's Olsen. 
And mark him down way up close to the 40 at the 39. A real letdown defensively. That was third and a bundle, but they allow the conversion. And he's gonna get a solid gain of nine before being brought down. Second and right at a yard. Tyron Matthew on the tackle. From just shy of midfield, Wilson, he finds his man, the tight end Olsen, as they've got things rolling on this drive. Here's Wilson. And the catch is made here by Tyler Lockett. Four 225 pounds out on the perimeter. But Tyler Lockett, he shatters all of those thoughts. Much more like a water bug, but maybe their most trusted target downfield. Led Seattle with 1,057 yards last season. Operates in the slot and outside. And oh! Lockett and it's intercepted. Picked off here by Anthony Hitchens. And a great return is... So after the INT, here's Mahomes. Got a man open. It's Ricky Seals Jones. And he'll have it past midfield. Oh. Here's a pass swung out left to his running back. And he gets this to the 30. Working from the gun, Mahomes. He lets this one fly toward the back of the end. In this ball game, I think the secondary has to be singled out there. They are in the presence of every receiver whenever the ball's thrown. And that's caught. It's Kelsey. <laughs> Touchdown, Kansas City. Touchdown. Travis Kelsey. 35 yards. And the Chiefs are a two-point conversion away from tying this thing up. And that was a beautiful ball right there as he waited for his tight end to come uncovered in the end zone to so give him points for patience as well. Delivered it right where it needed to be for six points. <laughs> Andy <laughs> Reid never wanted to shy away from taking chances. He'll go for two. Mahomes to throw once more. And this one incomplete. So they went for the two. They don't get it. I don't know about you, but I can't wait for a few years of two-point tries and see what the data tells us. Because a lot of teams want to throw the ball in this situation. This time, unsuccessfully. I just wonder if maybe he running the ball, ball might be the way to go. With it moved up from the three to the two, you would think maybe a few more attempts at option thrown in the red zone last time. We'll see if they can rebound. I just have to think the last thing he said as they went back out there was, don't do that again. What do you think? <laughs> what do you think? Yeah, I think that. I think that not only did he say that, but he also told him, let's put it in the end zone that it's supposed to be in, all right? The end zone we're trying what? to score. I know we're being a little bit facetious here, but the bottom line is take care of the football, and everything else should flow from there. Quick lesson, never ask the play-by-play <laughs> -play guy a question. Hey, you're my partner. I know you're right there with me. And able to find Dorsett. They throw the ball. They want to throw it downfield and sting defenses. And Philip Dorsett provides great speed and a good target. At the 32-yard line. Wilson slings this out to Metcalf. Wilson's pass. That catch good for five. It's third down. That's a gain of five. Brings up third and four. That's out to the left and complete. And he's taken down at the 43, but not before picking up the first. Back-to-back -back receptions for him, and it's another first down. On first down, Carson. And he'll take this one up close to a season progress. They added more and more to his plate. Now at times, Let's go. his size, his speed, and ability to catch the ball downfield, he looks downright on Stutter. Be careful. We can hit you going back the other direction. Wilson's throw caught by Metcalf, and he works it past the 30, almost to the 25. Another nice gain, 16 yards there, and a first down again. They'll run on first down. It's Carson, and this time they were waiting for him. It's going to be knocked down before he can get it. And Coachman, he's in Orlando, and he'll have our EA Sports halftime report. And now he's going to use his legs, and he's got room, and he will reach the from the gun, it's Wilson being chased out. And he's going to score. It's a Seahawk touchdown. An eight-yard touchdown run. And the Seahawks find a way to stretch their lead. Well, I'd have to say that for him, that was an all-encompassing drive because it was his arm that got his team down to that point. But his legs that finished the deal. 
Give him credit for making it happen. And he'll bang that one through. So that drive, 12 plays in length. And it was Russell Wilson finishing things off with a touchdown run. And after the touchdown, here's Myers to boot it away. Damn. Taken about seven yards deep. And only able to get to last in this league. Learned that lesson really early. You may have had a great stat run. Now the pressure comes and he goes down. Just inside the 10, back at the 9. Jaron Reed muscles his way in for the sack. It's second down. Another try after the first down sack. Mahomes. And that's going to be incomplete. Continue to be bold. And that is incomplete. It, okay. <laughs> they do go for it. It's Mahomes. They're going deep for Hill. And they will not oh. 10 yard line. That is caught at the seven yard line. And he's able to get it down to the two yard line. That's good for a gain of six. Second and goal. Oh! And he's going to go down just outside of the. <laughs> From the shotgun, Wilson. This will be caught at about the five. Wilson. Now the Seahawks going to use the run, probably pass to both in the arsenal. Under pressure now, and he's going to go down. And showing the play in the half as they come up here first and ten. They're going deep for Hill. And he backs no. second and ten. the gun it's Mahomes they're going deep for Hill he's got a man complete shotgun snap to Mahomes go final shot before the half for Mahomes oh throw is incomplete so we come upon halftime with, and now due to apparent time constraints, we fast forward to the beginning of the second half. Jason Myers to kick off for the Super Bowl champs trailing here, but they will get the ball first to begin quarter number three. And a fair catch signaled for and taken. Sucker, they talked about cleaning up some of the errors but overall i think they wanted to be positive with them guys we're right there just not playing as well as we need now here's mahomes going deep here for watkins that's caught inside the 20. goal range with designs i'm getting more than that now a first down carry it's williams nah, nah. and they get to him quickly here as he stopped right around the 13. Two yards that time, a stark contrast from the big chunk on the previous play. The last run good for two, here's second and eight. Throwing now is Mahomes. Good, Bobby! That wasn't Bobby. Travis Kelsey unable to pull it in, and it's third down. Whenever I see a drop like that, I have to kind of take a step back and check myself a little bit. So used to seeing those big guys make big time spectacular plays that when they drop one, I have to remind myself we ask a lot of these guys block and catch the football. Not easily done in today's NFL. Mahomes can sling it, but the feet are nimble too as he scrambles for a first down. Now that's disappointing for the defense. They had the advantage, had excellent coverage all over the field, but they let him get away, scramble, and pick up a first down and inside the five-yard line. Into a mass of bodies, and I think they held him out. They did. No gain there as he kept it himself at second down. Another shot from the one on second and goal. And he's going to go down just outside of the five, right around the six-yard line. Jaron Reed. Able to drop him that time for his second sack of the evening. So they were stopped trying to run the ball on first down. Now they take a sack on second down. The offensive coordinator's got to find a way to flip the script on the defensive coordinator because right now the defense has the advantage. A big play forthcoming. Here's third and goal. 
to throw. It's Mahomes. It's Kelsey. Touchdown, Kansas City. Travis Kelsey. Travis Kelsey. A beast in the red zone with his second touchdown of the game. And the Chiefs are able to get this back within a touchdown. All-pro tight end Travis Kelsey had 97 catches last yeah, year in the regular season on his way to a Super Bowl title with Kansas City. And while he's a weapon anywhere on the field, as you get closer to the end zone, you really have to look out. Witness what he did in the playoffs. Three touchdown catches against Houston in the divisional round and a big one in the Super Bowl against San Francisco, which keyed Kansas City's comeback. Andy Reid never one to shy away from taking chances. He'll go for two. Now Mahomes. And he's got it here for the two points, but there is a marker down, so we'll have to see what that's about. Charles, did I just hear that right? They declined the personal foul. Free yards, they just declined them. And I have to think that the official is thinking to himself, did I just hear that correctly, that you declined that one? All I can think of is that someone on the field got confused. Because it had to, because you're going to take the yards on that penalty each and every time. Fair catch made at the 25-yard line. The Seahawks take over first and... Here comes the Seahawks offensive unit. They'll have it first to begin the third. Pretty important third quarter drive for them. Momentum has sort of shifted the other direction after that last touchdown as they nurse this small lead. Wilson and the Seahawks take over now. First and 10 at their 25-yard line. He'll look to throw right away. And caught left side, Olsen. They'll be dropped after a gain of about six across the 30 to the 31. A gain of six there on first. Well, it's time for them to be good teammates right here. And what I mean by that is possess the ball for a little while. Get at least two first downs. Give their defense a chance to settle down a little bit after they give up a touchdown. And they take him down, losing yardage back at the 27. Frank Clark. I'm getting a sense that the momentum of this game is changing since the break. Nice play there, and this D is fired up. Oh, are we are we bragging? On third down, Wilson. <laughs> Wilson hit, it's loose. It's <gasps> what? And it's picked up by the Chiefs. Ah, and his crew will take over with a football at the 35-yard oh line. Tough end of that play. He had his eyes on that first down marker, but he lost his luggage along the way. <laughs> Left it behind, so to speak. I like your analogy there, but here's the key. As he's maneuvering, as he's picking up the first down, as he's gaining yardage, what's the one thing he forgot about? Ball security. Exactly. Everything else working perfectly, and he forgot the most important piece. Now after the fumble recovery, it's Mahomes. And nearly picked off there, and it would have been a great time for their first pick. Instead, it's second down. Shaquille Griffin. But defensively, you're over there trying to catch your breath and try not to show the offense that you're a little bit fatigued. You're right back out there after the turnover. Now they've got to work towards getting another couple of stops and forcing them into at least a long field goal situation. We sit in quarter number three out in Seattle, a second and ten now. Get the first down and more inside the 20. And all the way down to the 17-yard line. That one good for a first down pickup of 18 yards. A gain of 18. Boy, an effective play there, getting their wideouts involved in the run game. And what they're always hoping on that type of a play, that they can get to the end of the line and have a chance to turn it upfield as he did there. That means they controlled the blocking and took care of the defensive end of the outside linebacker to give him that lane. And I guess I need to clarify, I said getting their wideouts involved in the run game, but of course that was actually a pass as he popped it forward. Back-to-back -back nice gains, that one for 14 yards and another first. How about a guy proving his worth in different ways? Had the big play in the run game to play before. This time, they go right back to him in the passing game, and he comes through with yet another big play. That's why you work out so hard in the offseason, so you can stay on the field and accumulate big plays. Well, Travis Kelsey unable to pull it in, but it'll be second and goal. Line of scrimmage, again the four-yard line, second and goal. 
Now it's Mahomes again. And he will take it on in for a Chiefs touchdown. Mahomes hitting his favorite target, Travis Kelsey, on a touchdown pass. And the Chiefs have taken the lead. You get down near the goal line, this is where having a sure-handed tight end becomes a luxury, and it pays off big time, especially when the defense sells out against the run. He finds himself open for an easy touchdown. Now Mahomes to the line as the Chiefs are going to go for the two-point try. And again, it's Mahomes. And that's going to be intercepted. Jamal Adams with it. The all-pro safety. Pass the 10 to the 11-yard line. And that's where the return stops. It's interesting that when it comes to two-point conversions, even heavy run teams tend to throw the ball in these situations. In this case, this one was intercepted. Yeah, they weren't fooled. They were ready for the pass, picked it off. Now after the touchdown, here's Butker on to kick it away. Taken at the 15, a short kick. Now a crease here as he's past the 30. And they're going to start this drive in pretty good shape as they get it up past the 30. 32-yard line. The Kansas City defense, they make their way onto the field now. Wilson and the Seahawks take over now, first and 10 at about the 32. He gives it off to Carson. Yeah, give him four yards there. It'll be second and six. I feel like I can see what he was thinking on that carry. He wanted to follow that big tackle through the hole. Ended up only getting four yards on the carry. I think he had designs on that one being bigger. From the 35 on second down, Wilson going for Metcalf on the... He's got it! Hit the 15! And all the way in, touchdown Seattle! D.K. Metcalf, 65 yards. And the Seahawks are going to retake the lead. Pete Carroll in that familiar hands-on knees pose. His guys will go for two here. Throwing is Wilson. And he'll get into the end zone to push the lead up to a field goal. So that effort gives him a three-point cushion and guarantees that a field goal going forward won't beat them. Yeah, that's really good strategy because that's all you care about. Not getting beat at this stage, at least give your team a fighting chance. Fielded near the back of the end zone. And he will be taken down here on the return on what will wind up being the final play of this third quarter. Back now in Seattle, Washington. It's been a very hotly contested game to this point, just a field goal separating these two teams as we get set for the fourth quarter. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. And they will be looking to answer the touchdown. Their defense just surrendered. Still a good chunk of time remaining here in the fourth quarter. And a chance to regain the lead in a tight one. And yeah, they'll get it all the way up about five yards shy of midfield. A good pick up there. 26 yards. A big play to start him out. Has him at the 45 already. Mahomes going to throw. Complete the tight end Kelsey. Now he's going to get this all the way down inside the 35. That's now a pair of explosive plays in succession, both north of 20 yards. So from Seahawk territory now, it's first and 10. Down at the 33. Looking to throw is Mahomes. They'll set up the screen. This is Williams. Oh, Give me no, that. he lost the football. And the Seahawks have picked it up. And they will take over at the 26-yard line. What? Oh, the So they elect to decline it. And why not? Just go ahead and let the play stand, and they'll take that. So the special teams penalty cost some yardage there as they come out on first and 10. Here's Carson. Derek Nadi makes the tackle. Got to figure now, after getting that turnover, they're just going to be happy to keep the ball on the ground, right? This is where covering the football, taking care of the ball, all the ball security terms have ever been used. They come into play for the guys on offense right now. Just take care of it, and they've got a good chance of ending up winning this game. The reception good for seven. It's third down. What a great rookie campaign in 2019 for DK Metcalf, who came in with high expectations, was actually upset that he went in the second round, not the first round, but quickly proved everyone wrong who didn't take him prior. 900 yards receiving, 
seven touchdowns, and looks exactly like a Seattle Seahawks receiver is supposed to look. Big, strong, physical, and catches all the contested passes downfield. Just a yard on the run there, and that's going to bring us to a fourth down. Now that's a mountain of a man that just made that stop, isn't it? But he's more than that. This guy's nimble and quick. More than a space eater, he just made a great play there. Needing the tough yards, they run it with their fullback. And he will have first down yardage as he's brought down at the 41. A solid pickup of five and a very solid fourth down conversion and defensively pure frustration. Now Wilson on first down. They'll run the screen with Carson. A good pick up there on first as the screen pass gets him eight. Just about every quarterback is trained to really look downfield first before you come back and make a nice safe throw. And in this case, that's exactly what he did. Found his running back, let him create some space, and it turned out to be a nice play for the offense. On second down, it's Carson, and he'll get it into enemy territory just across midfield at the 49. Two yards, good enough for a first. First and not totally home free yet, but it's looking good as they come up first and 10. Three points separating these two sides with two minutes left to go in the fourth. So it's Seahawk football as we march toward a conclusion. And let's see what they've come up with offensively after having time to talk it over. Going for Metcalf on the deep ball. Oh and my this God. One is incomplete. The intended receiver was DK Metcalf. And that'll bring up second down. There is something to a game plan with trying to keep a defense honest with a guy with that type of speed. You do so. Send him deep. Try to throw some air under it and hope you connect downfield. On that play, they run successful. So after the incompletion on first, now second and ten. Wilson wants to throw it. He finds Dorsett. It's complete. Wilson. They do get a yard there, but only a yard. Leaves him with third and nine looming. One thing you're hoping for when you run drag routes, you're able to hit a receiver in stride, and he can pick up a lot of yardage after the catch. But in this situation, the defense was effective, able to stop him before he could get a good head of steam going. They'll roll him out right. He can run for it, and he will. And he's going to be out of bounds, but not before he takes it inside the 40. Give him 10 that time, escaping the danger, running with it, and picking up a first down. That is an absolute backbreaker. That was a design passing play, wasn't a draw. You think you got him stopped, good coverage downfield, and he's able to pick up the first with his legs. Defensively, that kicks into your psyche and hurts a little bit, doesn't it? It certainly does, and, and here's the thing. Anytime you give up a first down, it hurts you psychologically, but it hurts more when they get it this way because you've covered everything. He didn't have any place to throw the football. He takes off running and picks it up anyway, and now you have to stay on the field for an extra set of downs. And really could have used that stop trailing here in the fourth. They work again from the 38 on second and 10. Throwing now is Wilson. Steps away to his left. And he gets this down inside the 35 before going out of bounds. He'll wind up getting four there on his own, but it will leave him now with a third down situation. Looked to me like they adopted what my kindergarten teacher always said. If at first you don't succeed, try, try again. And finally able to hold him in check. He'd been carving him up running the ball. That's the first time I think I've seen where the coverage was good downfield and they accounted for him and stopped him for a short pickup. Yeah, I don't think it was a big... And look at this. They get the turnover they needed. It's intercepted. Picked off here by Anthony Hitchens. And he's able to get it back here to the 43-yard line. You got the slim lead late and the football, so why are you throwing it there? Remember during the year when we asked one of the head coaches, you know, if you're in this spot, why would you throw the ball? 
And he talked about trusting his quarterback and trusting his offense. But still. And then at the end, he kind of went, yeah, not really a good reason. Nice. <laughs> and this play will be blown up. He'll lose yardage back at the 38. Not what they had in mind there. That's going to go as a loss of four. So they had the big loss on that first down pass play and facing a second and long. He's going to let it fly. And that will be incomplete. Trying to dial up the long way way out there, but it'll be third down. He was covered by Jamal Adams. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means they'll need to come up with something here on third down. Now Mahomes. That one complete to Hill. Now he's going to get this all the way down inside the 35. The Chiefs will use the first of their timeouts as the clock will stop with 18 seconds remaining. So they'll come up first and 10 now from the 33. They fake the give. Now Mahomes. And that's going to be incomplete. 12 seconds left. He'll hold the intended receiver once again. And that'll bring up second down. An incomplete pass on first down. That leads to a second and 10. To throw is Mahomes. And oh! A crusher there as it's intercepted. Trey Flowers picks it. And a big turnover there as his guys will get the football back. Mahomes pass. Ooh, boy. You scared me. <laughs> you scared me. See if they want to use them. And now we'll get a timeout here. Oh, boy. With one second to go in this game. And they will take a knee here. Whew. So the victory here for Seattle. And they were really helped by their defense, forcing three turnovers. I think what we saw in this one, today's defense. And what I mean by that is in the old days, pitching shutouts was big time. That was paramount. But the big thing was holding people down, holding down their yardage, right? Don't let them throw the ball through the air and gain a lot of... But now, it's about taking the ball away taking away possessions, getting the ball back for their offense. They had three takeaways in this one, and it led them to victory.